Hi everyone,、uh, this is Miss Cho with IQ Abacus. And、uh, now we want to talk about how you use your workbook.、Um, this is level 10. Most of the people finishing the beginner stage will start with this level. No matter which hand you're using to write, you will use the right hand to operate the bees on an abacus.、Uh, most of the Uh, procedures are the same for both、uh, bo right handed or left handed people, except for a small portion that I will mention later. Okay, so first of all, let's open the workbook to the page that you want to use. Oh, the first page uh, is uh, very important, especially for beginners. Uh, try to uh, follow the instruction here to practice your four drills at home. We will do that in the class too. And on the back is for you to memorize your times table. Okay, today's focus is right here. So let's open the page, open to the first page, and、uh, do not fold the,、uh, the other half of the book to the back like this. This is not good because you are、uh, creating some bouncy part for your work and uh, uh, it's too thick.、Uh, It's not good for you to place an abacus like that. So just、uh, maybe wide open like this. Have a pencil in your hand, right hand. Now I'm talking about right handed people. If you are left handed, then use your left hand、uh, as what you usually do. Okay, so now I'm,、uh, I'm a right hander. So、uh, remember the five get ready steps. You need to sit up, make a tunnel, run to the train. And find your home point and have these two earth and、um, have a、uh, sky finger ready. So now I'm ready for the first question.、Uh, so, your left hand, make sure the tunnel hand has to be、uh, holding your abacus at all times du during the work. Let's place the abacus at the top so that you can easily to the two, see the two numbers and then. Uh, you start to、uh, the first number, okay, plus six, and then move down a little bit. Next one is plus seven. So you always sit straight up. You don't lean forward your body and、uh, try to see the number behind the abacus. If that's the case, that means you need to move your abacus down a little bit. So now I just、uh, do the first number, six. Now I use my left hand, move down a little bit so I can see the third number. But I'm、uh, looking at the number, second number, plus seven, two, five, minus three, get treasure. Then move down a little bit, I can see the third one, plus nine, by by one, get treasure. Then move down a little bit, and plus five, and a little bit, plus another five, and then plus two, and then plus three, five, two is three. And then plus one, and then plus four, it's bye bye six, get treasure. And then plus nine, bye bye one, get treasure. Okay, I finish all the ten numbers and I'm ready to write down the answer. I will just、um, move the, my abacus to,、uh, uh, to the top a little bit, and then my, I swing my、uh, pencil to the writing position. Then I can write down the first、uh, answer in the answer box, 51. So, okay, then I'm ready for the second question. So I will just repeat and I reset, just reset this part. I don't need to reset from the beginning to the end, just small choo choo right here. Then I place my abacus close to the top of the second question and then repeat the procedure. Uh, like what I did before, 9 plus 9, but by 1, get treasure, and plus 6, 1, 5, minus 4, get treasure, and plus 3, 5, 2 is 3, and plus 3, by by 7, get treasure, and plus 3, uh, plus 2, just plus 2 from bottom, and plus 8, 8 is a pinch number I can pinch, so the help is get treasure, by by 2, get treasure, and plus 8, just pinch. And plus seven, I can pinch, so get treasure for seven, by by three, get treasure, five, four is one. Then plus five, and just by by five, get treasure. Okay, and then again, move my abacus above it, 
uh, so I can see the answer box. Then copy down 60 on my book. Then I can run small choo choo and ready for the third one. Okay, so that's basically how you handle your uh, question. All then finish every all the question, the ten questions on the same page. Once you finish that, you can uh, log into iqabacus.com. Uh, then click on answer submission link. Follow the instruction to enter your answers on the computer, and uh, and then the system will check the answers for you. You will make the check mark. If it's right, just make a check mark. Check mark. If it's wrong, then make an X. And then uh, after you finish uh, checking, then you will go through those questions that's not right and do it all over again. And then get a second answer. If uh, the first answer I didn't do this, I'm just guessing. Maybe I the first time I did 39. If it's wrong, I would use two lines to cross that out and get a second answer in the second box. If it's still wrong, I cross out again and get a third answer in the third box. Uh, so that's what I would do. And I just finished, I think the, the answer is this. And you can even write it here. If you re really need more spaces, then you is, use eraser. If you don't have eraser, I mean, you don't need to use erasers all the time. Uh, okay, so f most of the above steps are the same for as the left-handed people, uh, except that uh, for left-handed people, sometimes we will suggest that you use uh, this kind of abacus that has three rubbers at the bottom, uh, but it's not so critical. The, any abacus can work the same way. Uh, if you need to have some uh, anti-friction things at the bottom. You can just wrap some rubber band on both ends. Then you still can use it as is. Why we need the the rubber at the bottom is because the left handers because you need to use your left hand to hold pencils. So you cannot move the abacus like the right-handed people. Uh, so you will just place your abacus at the bottom of the each question. Then use your left hand as the pointer, point to each question, uh, each number. So 6 and plus 7 to 5 minus 3 get treasure, plus 9 by, by 1 get treasure, and plus 5, and then plus 5 again, and plus 2 just from bottom, and plus 3 no bottom, so 5 is your help, 5, 2 is 3, and then plus 1 just from bottom, and plus 4 no bottom help, and no 5, so time to say bye bye, bye bye 6 get treasure. And 9, 9 is a pinch number. I can pinch, so I do by by 1, get treasure. Treasure is 5, 4 is 1. So do the same thing. And then, but you just don't need to move abacus. Then you are ready to write down the answer right here. Then reset and continue to the next question. So this is what the left hand people will do. Rest of them is about the same. Okay, so uh, hopefully you have a smooth. Uh, uh, process to take care of your homework. Just hang in there. Uh, if you do the homework uh, constantly, a little by little, every every day, uh, every time, or uh, three times a week at least, uh, you your math will be very very good. After a few months, uh, you will get the result. Okay. Thank you, everyone, and see you.